Hi Cancer, welcome to your February 1st through the 15th tarot reading. Crowning your read, I have the Two of Water and the Seven of Air. The Two of Water says a relationship that continues to grow closer, forgiveness, the positive re resolution of a conflict. And it's clarified by the Three of Swords and the Emperor. The Seven of Air says plans that need revision, more going on than meets the eye, poor timing. And it's clarified by the Three of Cups and the Six of Wands. So already seeing the Three of Cups with the Three of Swords, that just like makes my heart sink, guys. I'm so sorry. Um, some of you have been put into third party situations, perhaps with an Aries or a Taurus, because the Emperor is here. Um, maybe with another water sign. Um, But it's saying that there's forgiveness here, so maybe you're coming out of a third party situation, maybe some heartbreak regarding a third party situation. Oops. But there was definitely a betrayal here, a heartbreak. Yeah, definitely an Aries, guys, that some of you are dealing with. This person could have been very um, tyrannical. They were very power hungry. This person just wants attention, could even be, have some narcissistic tendencies is what I'm seeing. Two of Wands. Yeah, some of you have been making plans with this person, like maybe to be in a relationship, and this person came around and just broke your heart, because they were looking at other things, guys. If you're dealing with an Aries, they were looking at other things. They were planning with maybe another fire sign. It's crazy because they were making plans with you and then they were making plans with somebody else. Yeah, someone was trying to decide between two fire signs. It could be, you could, you could have fire in your chart and this could represent you. And there was definitely a third party situation here, guys. Two fire signs, Aries for sure. Aries for sure. Um, there was definitely a betrayal. Clarify the Queen of Wands, please. Interesting. If you have fire in your chart and you are a Cancer female, you are going to be coming out of this very nicely and moving into an energy of the Ten of Pentacles. This person could have been this curse this person could have betrayed you at a party is what I'm seeing. Or a get together. Six of Swords. Some of this this person could be at a distance from you, Cancer. This Aries perhaps, this Aries that broke your heart. Um, some of you are actually literally escaping this situation, like you're just deciding to move forward. I'm getting that somebody had a secret family, and that they were traveling to go visit their secret family, their hidden family. Yeah, there was definitely a deception here, Cancer, with a soulmate. Somebody was definitely, somebody has kids, guys. Somebody is very regretful of this, though. This Aries, perhaps. They're very regretful that they put you in this situation. I really am getting that there were a multitude of people here, guys. Like, it wasn't just... There was more than just three people involved. This person's a hoe. Just kidding. But, but really, though. Like, somebody here was putting many, many people in... In, they were not trying to, wow, this fell out of the deck, could have been a Leo, could have been a Leo that was in this third party situation, guys, a female Leo, perhaps, with a male Aries, Seven. yeah, someone's really disappointed, because they wanted the Ten of Pentacles, but... 
it's it's crazy because interesting. Sorry guys, I'm, this is all coming at me really fast. Um, somebody's really disappointed either in themselves. I, I'm getting that somebody's very disappointed in themselves. They're very regretful for what they've done because they were making plans with you. And the sun comes in. Maybe they tell you. Maybe somebody comes out and says, you know what, I was cheating. I'm getting that somebody comes out and tells the, just tells the other person. And I mean, I respect that because the sun is here, so that's illumination over a third party situation. Um, or just could be that there was a third party situation with the Leo. And somebody is very disappointed. I really think somebody's coming out and telling somebody that they've done this to them. Because somebody is very, feels very disappointed, feels very betrayed. Because they wanted the Ten of Pentacles. Maybe this, maybe this honesty brings out the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody's going to be honest with their partner for the first, second week of February. And that's going to bring out um, a, an energy of kind of like celebration and forward movement. Perhaps. Forgiveness. Yeah, guys, there was a third party situation here. So it could have been with somebody's friend. Somebody was a friend of a, like, somebody was a friend with somebody, and they hooked up with their friend. It really could have been somebody from a distance, and somebody is really, really regretful. Somebody could be planning how they're going to make you forgive them, or vice versa. There's a lot of third party situations right now in the collective, guys. Oh, I've seen a lot of third parties in almost every single reading I've done. The star card. Could have been an Aquarius you were dealing with. Or somebody's just having hope. Somebody's very hopeful about this situation. They're, they're feeling very regretful, but they're also feeling very hopeful. Maybe whoever this person is that's very honest, they're going to get the Ten of Pentacles with their person. Whoever is honest here, this was, there was something here that caused this third party situation. I'm getting that somebody felt very pressured by peers. And because of this, they feel very regretful because they, they, I'm getting that they never even planned to do this in the first place. It just kind of happened and somebody's feeling really bad, but the cups are already spilt and they, they're like, I can't take this back. I can't do anything to take it back. I wish I could. They're wishing they could take it back. Somebody's here wishing they could take something back. Um, and honesty comes in. Somebody's very honest, passionate communication comes through and illuminates the situation about a third party. And although some of, someone's feeling very betrayed, I think the honesty is what gets this person moving forward into the Ten of Cups energy. I mean, the Ten of Pentacles energy. Yeah, Ace of Swords. Somebody's coming through with some honest communication quick communication. Something is coming in, guys. Cancer, if you're the one in the third party, I'm not getting that this is your energy. I feel like somebody is going to be coming to you very soon. Very soon. And they're going to be being honest about a third party situation. If your intuition has been telling you that there's something been going on, be prepared because you might hear something. Because the Ace of Swords in here, this is a proposal. Somebody is proposing to be a better person is what I'm hearing. They're proposing to move forward, to put in more work, to put in more effort, to reject this person should they ever come about again. Yeah, there's a lot of fire energy here, guys. Somebody is a big old player. There is somebody here that is a big old player. If you're dealing with an Aries... Th this person's a player. And they're, they're moving fast in other directions. While somebody else is waiting. Some of you could be waiting for this honesty to come through. Maybe some of you know. You know that there's a third party situation that's gone on. And you're just waiting for this person to come out and be honest. Or you're waiting for them to slip up. That way you can go ahead and cut their ass out. If you're a cross watcher and you've put a cancer in a third party situation, guys, you either you better be honest or not fuck up because somebody is keeping a close eye on you. They're watching you. 
they're keeping a very close eye because someone is ready to cut somebody else out because they know that somebody's been lying. There's a lot of deception here. Some of you could be taking a blind leap of faith with this person, though, if they are honest. If the honesty does come out, this person is going to take a blind leap of faith. Someone could have been making a decision about a friend, or if you have fire in your chart, they were making a decision about moving forward with you with or with a friend. Knight of Cups. Some of you could be meeting another water sign here very soon, or you're going to be moving forward from, from a fire sign that you've been waiting too long on. Could be a Leo. You feel like you've been waiting too long on this person, and you're like, nah, they've already betrayed me. I can feel it in my soul. Even if I'm getting that some of you are going to be getting this honesty, and you're going to decide to move forward. Even with the honesty, even though you're like, I don't give a fuck that you're regretful. I don't give a damn how bad you feel, how hopeful you are of this situation. Somebody was very blind, but they were guarded because they knew they knew something was up. Somebody knew something was up, and they were very blind. They didn't have the full evidence there in front of them, but they still knew something was up, so they had their arms crossed. You were very guarded to this person because you had a feeling they were going to break your heart. And I think that once this honesty comes through, that's going to be enough for some of you to just be like, okay, you know what? This person's not worth it. I'm going to walk away. I'm going to walk away and I'm going to give my cup to somebody else. Perhaps an earth sign or an air sign. Some of you could have been planning with this person, like planning to move forward with this person, and these plans need revision. You need to look at planning something with, something, with somebody else. Five of Earth, fear surrounding money, the wisdom to accept help from others, uncertain self-employment. This could have been a work situation, this third-party situation could have been with somebody from work. Or maybe, I really think that you should go to your friends, guys. Go to somebody else's friends and ask them questions. If this person isn't budging and they're not telling you all you need to know or all that you deserve to know, this person, I'm hearing that some of this, this person, this Aries, this Aquarius, um, their friends will have answers for you. Seek advice from their friends, perhaps. Um, but yeah, like some of you guys are going to be moving forward away from this and you're going to be moving into a happier energy once you do, because you're going to get some truth that comes in. Some honest communication is going to come in guys about a betrayal. Somebody betrayed somebody else guys. And you're going to be moving away from this person, Cancer. That's all I got for you guys today. If you'd like to book a personal read, DM me. I charge $20 for personal reads. And other than that, I will see you guys next week or in two weeks. Have a wonderful rest of your two weeks, guys, and happy Valentine's Day. Bye.